Okay, um, this is going to be, <clears throat> excuse me, a review on the Gerber dime. There's a ton of them out there, but I've just carried this for so long, I figured it's about time I do a review of it. Um, I just added a little oh, two-inch lanyard just to make it easier to pull out of my pocket. This is my EDC multi-tool. Um, <clears throat> so that's why I did that. Bottle opener is a nice. You can put a keychain or something on there, too, if you don't want to use it as that. It does have a keychain ring here, but that's what I have my lanyard off of. Um, first thing they have are the scissors. I need to grease them up because they usually work better than that. I just haven't used them in a while. <coughs> that is not why I got this tool. <coughs> um, this is a can opener slash you could use it for like making a hole similar to an awl, uh, that kind of thing. This again is not why I got this tool. Um, this blade is kind of why I got this tool. I think the shape is super cool. Um, it's sharp. It does what I need it to do. I don't have any need for a gigantic pocket blade on me. <clears throat> this is a Phillips slash small flathead slash file on both sides. Um, it's not going to file your knife down, but it will fire, file your nails. So, um, And then on the other side is a, just a regular size flathead. could also be used as a prying device. Um, pretty sturdy. So. Then on the inside, pliers. I use pliers all the time. Um, a major reason why I got this and not like the Micra, the Leatherman Micra, which comes with scissors as the main tool. I just don't use scissors enough. If I need to cut something, I typically use my blade, um, a knife of some kind. Unless, God, I don't even know when I use scissors unless I'm at work and I use trauma shears. There's just not enough applications for scissors for me, whereas pliers can be used for a multitude of things. Also, there's a wire cutter on here, which works pretty well. It's got the needle nose on it. Um, and they're spring-loaded, which I really, really like. Uh, Leatherman doesn't typically have spring-loaded pliers. Another reason why I went with this. It is just, it's so easy. I mean, two fingers, you can push it against yourself and use it with one finger. It's just amazing. A big reason why I got this. And then it's, the more I carry it, the more I love it. I know I'm always going to have this on me. I'm always going to have a pair of pliers. I'm always going to have a blade. I'm always going to have a screwdriver. Um, something that surprised me about this tool. The, well, the, um, the look of it, I like it. It's pretty cool. It's a little tactical, but it's not, um, I like the color. It's just black. I have one that's like green and silver, so, green and gray, something like that. They come in red and whatever color it is. Whatever. This one you can see, it's a little scratched up. There's some paint missing. I, it rides in my pocket. I'm not careful with it. I beat the crap out of this thing because I use it every single day. Um, but something that surprised me. Tweezers. I use these all the time. They are not as good as the tweezers that come on a Swiss Army knife, but they are darn close. And for this size, and for this company, and for this tool, there's, there's nothing better. Um, I get slivers a lot. Especially when I'm out in the woods or whatnot, some tick you could use it for. They're not coming out. They're not going to fall out. They squeeze in there very nicely. Um, this tool is just so easy to deploy. It's got everything that you're going to need um, on a day-to-day -day basis. It's small. It's lightweight. It's got a pliers, a knife, screwdriver set, scissors, but whatever, tweezers, and then a can opener. I just I love this tool. I don't know what more I can say about it. Um, the price point is there. I couldn't tell you the numbers off the top of your head, but, you know, it's very comparable to those of similar size. Um, it's, it's just a great all-around tool. Uh, like I said, this goes with me everywhere. This is part of my EDC. So, um, I think that's a great use for this, for this tool. This is not a wilderness multi-tool that's going to have a saw and an awl and all this stuff on it that you could use in the bush. Uh, that's not what this tool is for. That's not what this tool was made for. This is an EDC, everyday carry, beat around, use every day for day-to-day -day tasks. 
tool, and it's great at that. Um, I know everybody has their opinions about Gerber and Leatherman and blah, 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 blah. I just wanted to put two, my, my two cents out there. There are a ton of great reviews on this tool. I just wanted to um, kind of say my piece and get it out there. So, thanks, guys.